Toronto Rock head coach John Lovell, uh, big win here in Montreal, exhibition game, but your thoughts on uh, on the game, offense and defense? Well, I, thought, I think we, we were a pretty good package here today. Got good goaltending, we were really solid defensively, solid killing penalties. Our offense uh, moved the ball extremely well and, and we're, we had a pretty nice looking power play and you know, we had lots of opportunities. So it was a great game to practice all those aspects too. So. Um, you know, we don't get any points in the standings for it, but I still think it was it was a good thing for team building and, and just playing the game the way it's supposed to be played. You got a chance to look at your lineup with maybe some you know some of the regulars that are going to be playing this season. Uh, what were your thoughts on maybe uh, you know Brody Merrill's game and uh, some of the other guys that came in here? Josh Sanderson hadn't uh, played an exhibition game. How did they look in your eyes? Well, you know, Josh has been around for a while, so you, you everybody feeds off his leadership. So he was. He was great in the dressing room, and, and it does so much for all of us. Uh, and Brody does exactly what he's been doing in this league for for a number of years. You know, a presence on defense, uh, a guy that can transition the ball. He's always around the play because he sees the floor so well, and and so that that was you know it's just really critical to what we do, and, and you know it helped it helped a lot. Now talking about the, some of the younger players looking to crack this lineup, uh, did they make it difficult on you today? Some guys played some some good games out there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I, it's it's going to be some some really difficult decisions here. Uh, uh, I, I mean, I wish we could just stand right here and and, and run with who we have, but uh, obviously we can't keep everybody. So there's going to be some tough tough choices, you know, come next week, and and, and it's unfortunate, but. Uh, but well, I think it says a lot to, to you know the work that Terry Sanderson did in the off season and stuff to to find some people that, that can play and make it competitive and uh, you know I wish he was around to help to, to make these final decisions here too. I just want to ask you too about Brett Hickey and Brandon Ben both seem to play uh, fairly smart games offensively and seem to work well together at times as well. Uh, maybe just a comment on both of their games. Well, I thought they both uh, exactly what you said. Uh, Brett is a big body, and, and we certainly could use that on that side. And on that side, he shoots the ball well. And uh, <clears throat> you know, for a guy coming on the junior and Brandon Ben, um, I mean, I guess there's a reason he scored the number of goals that he did in junior. He's a very intelligent player with the ball, and uh, he goes to the net well. So uh, both of those guys look like they can play. I hope we can find room to keep both of them. And anything different defensively?